DJI just released a new version of the DJI Mini, which is the DJI Mini 3 Pro, which will be an upgrade to the Mini 3. So let us take a look at the difference and which one you might want to consider buying. First, let us talk about the newly features. The new DJI Mini 3 Pro just got an obstacle sensor, which was not introduced with the DJI Mini 3. So the Mini 3 Pro has what we call a PAS, an Advanced Piloting Assistance System. So what this does is that the drones can dodge an obstacle. Go around an obstacle using the new sensor added to the Mini 3 Pro. We also have focus tracking where the DJI Mini Pro also shines in this segment. This basically allows the drone to focus on a particular subject, which means when the drone is focused on a particular subject, the drone can follow the subject and record along, and the Mini 3 Pro has an upgrade from the 12 megapixel camera, which the Mini 3 has to a 48 megapixel, which is capable of capturing more details in a footage. The Mini 3 Pro can shoot at 460 fps, while the Mini 3 can only shoot at 430 fps. Keep in mind that the Mini 3 can go up to 10 km in range, while the Mini 3 Pro bumps up to 12 km in range. The price of the Mini 3 is $469 without the remote control, while the Mini 3 Pro goes up to $669. In my conclusion, if you do not need obstacle avoidance, great camera output up to 460 FPS, focus tracking, and the advanced feature and do not want to spend much on a drone, the DJI Mini 3 is great for you. But if you want more advanced features that are available to the Mini 3 Pro, then I guess the Mini 3 Pro is great for you. To know more about the upcoming DJI Mini 4 and how it might shock you, click here. We have no affiliate link down below, so the only way to support us is to subscribe.